Hey guys, Dynamics Gamer here. My real name's Jacob Livingood, and today we're gonna do a face reveal. Well, sort of. Outside of just being a Supercell gamer, I'm actually a world-renowned entrepreneur and blockchain educator, specifically honed in on blockchain gaming, because I do love video games. Now, besides being at a professional competitive play level for Clash Royale and Brawl Stars, I actually teach people about blockchain games, and that's what we're gonna turn this channel into. Part of this channel will be an educational portfolio for people to learn and understand blockchain. So let's jump in the computer and go over a revolutionary game that is on the precipice of releasing. Come on. First, I want to touch on what is blockchain gaming and why you should actively be looking at getting educated and involved in these ecosystems. Gaming is a $385 billion industry growing at a 15% CAGR or compound annual growth rate and is expected to reach $600 billion by 2030. Epic Games Fortnite did $5.2 billion of in-game skins in 2022 alone. It's also important to note that 0% of that revenue was trickled down the grapevine to financially aid or benefit the end users, the actual players of the game. This is where blockchain technology comes in. Blockchain gaming is exactly what it sounds like. It's video games that utilize blockchain technology. Now you may be asking yourself, well, what's blockchain technology? I'll use a simple analogy to explain it. Imagine you have a notebook where you write down all the things you buy and sell. Now imagine that you have a lot of friends who also have their own notebook and they also write down their own transactions. One day, you and your friends decide to create a special type of notebook where everyone writes down their transactions together. This notebook is called a blockchain. The cool thing about the blockchain notebook is that every time someone writes down a new transaction, all of their friends get a copy of the page with the new transaction, and each page is connected to the previous page, just like a chain. So it's really hard for someone to go back and change something that's been written before because everyone would notice the change. This means that blockchain technology is very secure and trustworthy. People can use it to buy and sell things online, like video games or tickets to a concert, without worrying that someone may steal or cheat. In addition to buying and selling things, people are utilizing blockchain technology for all sorts of cool things, like voting, storing important documents, or even tracking where our food comes from. So, that's a basic breakdown of fundamental principles of blockchain technology. Now imagine you build a video game on top of this technology. Let's use Fortnite to solidify this concept in your mind. When you buy a skin in the game to have a more enjoyable, custom gaming experience for you, you now own that digital asset. It would be known as a non-fungible token, or an NFT for short. Having full digital ownership of that digital asset, or NFT, would also mean that you'd have the free liberty to sell it on the secondary market at a later date when you no longer wanted or needed it, and thus, you've derived real economic value from playing a video game that you enjoy. Let's take it a step further. Say the in-game currency, i.e. V-Bucks in this specific example, is actually a cryptocurrency that you can yield or earn through playing the game and then swap or exchange into another cryptocurrency or even US dollars if you so choose. Now you're generating economic value simply by playing a video game that you enjoy in a free-to-play manner. Isn't that so neat? Now you understand the capabilities of what the convergence of blockchain and gaming can be. Also, by the way guys, this isn't some theoretical future technology that might happen at some random undetermined date. This technology exists now and is able to be capitalized on immediately. The only reason more people aren't earning digital money from playing video games is because of a lack of awareness. You simply don't know what you don't know. That brings me to our primary topic for today's video. I thoroughly enjoy mobile strategy games like Clash Royale and Brawl Stars, which is why I built a gaming brand around them. But weirdly enough, I actually play other games too. Who would have thought? I'm a big fan of shooters. Whether that's an FPS or third person, I personally don't have a preference. But I've been a big fan of the Call of Duty franchise since the original release of Modern Warfare 2 all the way back in 2009. But what if there was a game with similar game mechanics as Call of Duty that was blockchain enabled? Well, there is. Introducing Bionic Owls. Here you can see some gameplay footage behind me of this beautiful game while I'll go over some of its features. First off, let's answer important questions about the game. What chain will the assets be minted on? The assets are going to be minted on Ethereum and Polygon. Users will be able to claim their assets through self-custody wallets. This is going to ensure that players have complete control over their assets and can claim them whenever they want. Now, are those assets purely going to be aesthetic, or will they include stats that alter the gameplay? Some assets will be purely aesthetic, and some assets will have gameplay altering stats. But don't worry, the game is designed to be fair and balanced. Players can earn their assets in-game and use them to enhance their gameplay experience. The game is by no means pay to win, and players cannot purchase an unfair advantage. Now let's talk about game modes on launch. 
The game will be launched with multiple game modes, including Capture the Flag, Player vs. Environment, and Team Deathmatch, among others. This ensures that players have a variety of options to choose from and can play the game in many different ways. Now, the overall key focus of this game is to be an NFT-enabled, play-to-impact, play-to-earn game that is designed to bring inclusivity to the Web3 space. This means that players can earn rewards by playing the game and contributing to the ecosystem. Now, we'll go over some of the specs that are necessary, minimum requirements, and recommended. I'm not going to blab on about all that. I'll just pop them up here on the screen that you can read. So that's everything that you need to know about this upcoming amazing blockchain game. You can learn more about it at bionicowls.io. You should absolutely follow them on social media and join their Discord community so that you can learn more and stay up to date about their upcoming avatar collection of 3,600 custom PFP avatars that will be metaverse characters for their future game launch. Anyways, love you guys. Peace.